Hey guys, it's Jack here from Techno Assistant. Today, I'm just going to show you um, how to move people. You can delete people. You can make things bigger. You can you can do anything with this content aware tool. It is amazing. But uh, so we're just gonna drag in this uh, picture of zebras from GlobeImages.net into Photoshop. All right, guys. So the first thing we're gonna do is we are going to duplicate the slayer because it has that little lock thing next to it and uh... now you want to go to your content aware tool and uh... if it's not there you just right click and click content aware move tool so right now we're just gonna move this zebra looks like it's having a little fun but, uh, so let's move him over here alright and there you go guys and as you can see the edges aren't like too nice but you can barely tell so then you just want to grab your patch tool and you just select the part that you don't like whoops I actually selected it so like that let's just fix that part you just select something from another place like that see a problem fixed alright but uh... we are going to extend someone now and uh, back to the content aware tool here's the adaptation very strict there's strict there's medium there's loose and there's very loose I like to stick with either strict or medium because sometimes it'll get like a little chippy and uh, chop well not choppy but like chippy and like it won't look very good on uh, very strict so I like to keep it medium and then uh loose isn't too bad. Loose would be loose would be okay on this one I guess since there's like a huge meadow. But uh you just we're gonna just gonna move this guy now. And now we are going to extend him. So you just wanna change this from move to extend. And you just wanna grab him. That probably wasn't good enough. Maybe that wasn't good enough. I didn't get uh didn't get enough into him, so we're just gonna extend his head. So there you go, guys. We just ex ex yeah extended his head. Um, but uh, as you can see, there's that little hump there. So we're just gonna zoom in on this guy and uh, fix that with our patch tool. All right. So you're just gonna grab his little fur. We're just gonna make it match like one of these. Alright, so that's okay. I mean, you can do more with it. Uh, you can make it look better than I did, but this is just a tutorial. So, uh, a bunch of donkey butts. Um, let's get out of natural pixels. Alright then. Okay, you see that little thing back there? We are just going to extend that. Alright, and then I will show you guys how to delete stuff. But let's just extend this first so we can get a little practice. So you just want to select that. And this will be good to have it on medium. I'm just going to extend that like that. So things grass now. You can make this really long if you really wanted to, but you know, I don't have, I'm not going to do that. But, um, so yeah, and then you can just use the patch tool on this. But, um, so let's just use the patch tool on that. Looks like, like this. So that's a little better. So that's that's pretty good. Now it looks like there's a bush there. All right, but um, that stuff doesn't look too good. So we're just gonna switch that with this. All right, so there we go. There's a bunch of grass and stuff back there. But uh, now we're just gonna erase one of these guys. So we're just going to choose this unlucky zebra here. So we're just gonna hit move and and you're just gonna select 
that. And then you just hit delete. Oops. No, we're just going to move him uh, off of the picture. Because I'm not sure if you can do that. Or is it? Uh, no, let's just delete him. And then, with the patch tool... And just select some place that everyone wants to cooperate. So you should just circle that and then drag it somewhere that looks good to you. And it's not being very nice to me, so I'm just gonna grab my paint bucket tool and my goodness, I swear. Oh, I don't want. There we go. Alright. And then we're just gonna. Oh no. Oh my gosh. I swear. This new Adobe program is kind of different from the other one. Alright, so basically what we're gonna do here is we're gonna go into that and just delete that right here. So we're gonna inverse it. Alright then, so now we are going to fill this up. So now we can delete this layer. Alright, but now now you can patch it. It's going to let you patch it. See, watch. Alright, there you go. So there you have it, and it looks exactly like that, so we're just going to switch this to make it its own unique thing. So that, that, this... I mean, he's completely gone. You can do this with people on the beach. You can do this with pretty much anything. But, um, yes, yeah, so you can you can erase anything here. See, like, you can make, oops, I had the patch tool. You can make anything, like, disappear. It's just a great new feature made by the developers of uh, Photoshop. So we're just going to move his horn. Oh, you need to get it on extend if you're going to make his horn longer. Okay, I really screwed that up. Um, alright, well, um, so that's pretty much it. That is the content aware tool. And, uh, here you have pretty much the same thing. Uh, there's a 3D material drop tool. I don't know what that is. I'm interested to find out what that is. I think you might have to... It's just... Hmm. Okay. I, I don't know why it's not letting us use that. But, um, so that's pretty much it, guys. Uh, please subscribe, comment, and like us on Facebook. Alright, see you guys. Bye.